Hello everybody, this is Michael Smiley coming at you with another video. Um, tonight I'm going to be talking about the movie Silent, or movies actually, of Silent Hill. Now, Silent Hill... <sighs> Sorry guys, it's really late. Um, of course I'm always doing this at night time, but... Um, Silent Hill, so, I believe the first one came out in 2004, maybe, 2004, maybe 2005, somewhere around there, and, um, I loved the first movie because it was so different than anything that was out at the time. I mean, it still is different than anything that is even released today. Um, the story was really weird, uh, but that's what set itself apart from anything else. Um, I did play... <clears throat> I did play the video game, and like once or twice, and it was insane. Uh, yeah, it was crazy. It was wild. Um, so I, I really, really loved the first movie. I did enjoy it. Um, and obviously I was hoping that there would be a second one, and they did make a second one. I really, really, really loved the second one, and I loved, I, I actually enjoyed the second one more than the first one, um, and I know that uh, that's probably an unpopular opinion, but I, I really did, I really did enjoy it. Um, There's so much, there was so much story going on in the first one, which is really excellent. Um, and there was so much going on, and it was really, it was really crazy, it was really out there, and at the end you were like, what is going on? Is this, is this real life? Is it like in between stages? Like, what is, what is going on with this ending? And... I really like the fact that the second one really picked up the story and took it even to a further dimension and everything. It was so crazy. Uh, if you haven't checked out the movies Silent Hill, you should. Uh, it's sad, actually, that they haven't made more. Uh, they could have done so much more with the franchise. Um, I don't know why they didn't make a third one, because I'm pretty sure that at least the first one was successful. I don't know if the second one was or not, but the second one was released when the whole 3D craze was really exploding. Um, yeah. So I'm pretty sure that it did make some money. So I'm not exactly sure why they haven't released a third one. They should. Uh, yeah. Let me know what you guys think. I know that there's a lot of gamers out there that have their own opinion because, you know, book readers have their own opinion about the movie version, you know, that kind of thing. Same thing with game, vi you know, video games to movies. I mean, I didn't play Silent Hill, the game, really, and really pay attention to the story. I just, it was just really crazy and a lot was going on, and um, I lost horribly at the game. Uh, but, I don't know. I, I really like the movie. I really love the style. The styling and the, the really... Uh, creep factor of it all because some things are just really creepy that are in the movies and well also the games too but in the movies <clears throat> some things kind of remind me of the Resident Evil series like that guy 
or demon, whatever he is, with the great big thing on his head that goes around with a huge sword weapon thing or whatever, totally reminded me of the Resident Evil series. But other than that, it's all original stuff. Um, at least as far as I'm concerned, I haven't seen anything that's anything like the Silent Hill series, besides that one creature. Um, <clears throat> but I think that Sean Bean was in the first one. It's been a really long time since I've um, seen the Silent Hill movies, but it, it's, it's just something that I've thought about re-watching. Um, recently, so, um, I'll have to buy those movies at some point, because I really, really love them, and I do highly recommend them. Um, I, uh, it's just so crazy, crazy, because you think that the, the good people are good, and the bad people are bad, but there's so much more story, and, um, so much more crazy chaos stuff that really, dilutes that uh, train of thought because well you'll have to watch it because I'm not a spoiler you know kind of person but um, it's insane and um, yeah so check it out I highly recommend it the special effects are really crazy um, like I said, the styling, the special effects, the acting is really cool. I, I mean, they do a really good job of that. Um, they do a really good job with the pacing, with the story. It's really rich with story, actually, for being a horror movie. Um, but, like I said, I, I wish that they'd make a part three because they could just do uh, so much more with this. And... Um, it'd be really cool to see it, you know, a 2019 or a 2020 version of Silent Hill, like a third one. I think that it would be really crazy to see. So, especially with today's effects. And it'd be really cool if, like, James Wan, um, or somebody like that got a hold of the franchise because... They've done so excellent with the Insidious series, the Conjuring series, um, now Aquaman, um, the Fast and Furious, uh, the Saw movies. Like, they do an excellent job. So, um, and Blumhouse, or, yeah, Jason Blum should be the, pr the producer. I think that. Uh, Silent Hill would would um, really resonate with today's audiences, especially the horror genre, because it's really taking off with Happy Death Day and um, the Conjuring series and the new Halloween um, that just came out last year was a huge hit because it was so so excellently done. <clears throat> So I really do think that they should make another Silent Hill. Um, let me know what you guys think about it um, down in the comment section. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. And have a great night, guys.